Why play Singe Top? Well, he is incredibly mobile, running insanely fast. He is frustratingly impossible to lock down and kill. He's very easy to farm with, and brings brilliant peel for both himself and his team. However, he is weak at early game, being prone to ganks, and he's not a great duelist, relying heavily on kiting. Singe's passive is he has a chunk of movement speed when moving past an ally or enemy champion. Singe's Q is his bread and butter. It's an ability he can toggle on and off, and when toggled on, he leaves a poisonous trail behind him, and when enemies walk through it, they take magic damage per second. Singe's W throws down a circle on the floor which will slow all enemies and also ground them. Singed as E is a point and click ability which throws a champion a good distance over his shoulder dealing damage. In addition, if they are thrown into his W they are also rooted. Singed as ultimate works as a huge steroid giving him a large amount of ability power, armor, magic resist, movement speed, as well as both health and mana regen. Also, it makes his Q apply 25% grievous wounds to reduce healing. So yeah, his ultimate feels pretty overloaded. For combos, the main thing you want to do is to keep running past them for your passive speed increase with your Q turned on making them chase you. This will deal tons of damage if they keep chasing you and will keep you incredibly safe, and if they get too close simply throw down a W and then throw them into it. For masteries there's many things that work, but this is a great one for damage, and this is a great one for even more movement speed. For build order start Dark Seal Refillable or a Corrupting Potion. Before getting tier 2 boots, Crystal Scepter and Demonic. Following this get a Rift Maker as your mythic, before completing your build with any of these. For skill order start Q then E then a second point in Q before taking W. After this max Q then E then W taking ult whenever you can. For Summoners take Flash and Ghost. Starting the laning phase, your main goal is not to kill your opponent, but to be incredibly frustrating and annoying to play against. You can do this in several ways, with the easiest way being to simply run around their minions, poisoning them all dead for easy farm, more or less completely ignoring your opponent and refusing to interact with them. This way, if your opponent ever tries to stop you or goes for a trade, they have to come through your poison cloud, and due to your passive, as they've come close to you, they've now given you a speed up so you can kite them even easier while poisoning them. And worst comes to worst, simply flip them away anyway. The even more annoying way to play, however, is if you know their junglers on the other side of the map, you can go between their towers and start poisoning their minions in proxy. You normally only want to do this for a couple of waves so you don't get punished, but it will put your opponent under some serious pressure, not being able to leave their tower without losing tons of farm. And of course, if they come to stop you, you just run away poisoning them. Once you've got a few levels in Q and a bit of AP behind you, your Q will kill minions incredibly fast and you'll be too fast for your opponents to deal with. If they send multiple people to deal with you, you'll waste a ton of their time simply running away and flipping them away. And there's a good chance you survive anyway. It's all about being as cheeky and obnoxious as possible, making not killing you worth it, while you get your team tons of map pressure. Entering mid game it's a lot more of the same. Once you have Crystal Scepter your Q will now slow them which makes chasing you even more frustrating. Keep pushing hard and drawing attention. For late game team fights you can play the role of your team's engage. If you run over their entire team applying your poison which will now slow and apply grievous wounds before flipping a carry into your team rooting them with your W is a very good way to start every fight. And if you get targeted simply sprint away with all your movement speed buffs while your team collapses onto them. Keep running around the fight, being annoying, poisoning your targets and flipping as you can.